I would now like to take this opportunity to highlight some of the many outstanding accomplishments of the class of 2017. 58 students satisfied requirements of state-approved career completer programs at our school or at the Career and Technology Center. Will our career completers and career and tech students please stand? Seventy-seven students received the President's Award of Excellence. They have received their Presidential Award for Educational Excellence pins. Would these students please stand? <laughs> Would the following students please stand? Nicholas Corona, Eric Dulles, Leah Elsner, Megan Epler, Rebecca McLean, Caroline Olson, and Claire Vervac. These students received recognition as National Merit Scholarship commended students for outstanding performance on the PSAT. Nick also received recognition as a National Hispanic Scholar. Congratulations. Alphabetically, the following students are in the top 5% of their class based on weighted GPA. These students are wearing gold cords. Please stand as your name is called. Lauren Bishop, Alexandra Byrne, Nicholas Corona, Cameron Ducey, Eric Dulles, Megan Epler, Jacqueline Jew, Corey Luth, Stacy Mulholland, Jessica Queen, Jessica Stolte, and Haley Zawatowski. Top 5%, congratulations. <laughs> We'd like to honor our students who have received a final grade of A in every high school course. We are proud to announce that 11 students have received such an honor. Would the following students with a perfect final transcript please stand? Nicholas Corona, Rachel Cueva, Eric Dulles, Robert, Robert Isel, Corey Luth, Isley, I'm sorry, Corey Luth, Caroline Olson, Jessica Queen, Natalie Smith, Jessica Stolte, Claire Verbeck, and Haley Zabotowski. All A's in high school. <laughs> 158 students in this class took 314 advanced placement exams in 20 different content areas this year. 48 students in this class successfully completed seven or more advanced placement or college level classes during their high school career. Will the following students please stand? Nicholas Corona, Eric Dulles, Keelan Gallagher, Jacqueline Jew, and Jessica Queen. These five students successfully completed 12 or more AP or college level classes during their high school career. Quite an accomplishment. Seven of our accounting students earned transcripted college credit for their work this semester. Will graduates who have been accepted into one of the branches of the armed services please stand? Remain standing. Now I would ask that these students be joined by members of the audience who have served or are currently serving in a branch of the armed forces. Would anyone in the audience who is or has served stand and be recognized?
Our students logged more than 42,102 service hours. That's an average of 170 hours per student, even though only 75 hours were required for graduation. Would Parker Hipsley and Shannon Housden please stand? Parker earned 978 and a half service hours and Shannon earned 781 service hours. They were our top two seniors in terms of service hours. In athletics, the class of 2017 had a great deal of success. During the past school year, we had two state semifinalist teams, boys and girls lacrosse, five region championship teams, boys cross country, field hockey, boys lacrosse, girls lacrosse, and tennis. We had team county championships in boys cross country, football, boys tennis, and girls tennis. There were many state participants in girls cross country, wrestling, indoor and outdoor, uh, track, and tennis. Will the varsity field hockey players please stand? These students were members of the 1A, 2A Liberty State Championship field hockey team. Will the varsity boys cross country team please stand? These students were members of the 2A state championship team. Repeat state championship team. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Will the members of the 2017 boys 4x800 relay team please rise? <laughs> This past month, these students won the state championship in that event. The Lions Pride Marching Band placed third at the Atlantic Coast Championships with a score of 97.5 with awards for high visual and high brass. The score of 97.5 is the highest score for marching band in the school's history. The marching band also took first place with a score of 93.9 at the Chapter 5, which includes Maryland, Virginia, and West Virginia championships, winning awards for high music, high visual, and high auxiliary. Can I have the members of the band please stand and be recognized? The Wind Ensemble and Orchestra earned straight superior ratings in all A grades at the Carroll District Festival. 26 students were selected for all county band, 20 students were selected for all county orchestra, and seven students were selected for all state instrumental music. Would Eric Dallas, Josh Alford, and Jay Fenner please stand? These seniors were selected for all state band or orchestra. In addition, senior Eric Dellis was selected for the 2017 All Eastern Band, the first student to receive this honor in over a decade. All Eastern participation is earned through three or more years of consecutive all state selection as well as a competitive audition. Congratulations to our orchestra members. In vocal music, the LHS Madrigals and Chorale earned an overall one rating, qualifying them for the state festival. Both groups also competed at the Festival of Music Competition in Hershey, PA, earning first place in the AA division and overall best choral ensemble of all divisions. Twelve choral students were selected for all county chorus, three were selected for all state senior chorus, and two were selected for all state junior chorus, and two for all Eastern. Lauren Bishop and Jeremy Lewin, please stand.
Lauren and Jeremy were selected for All-State Senior Chorus and nominated for All-Eastern Chorus. Lauren was also selected to perform in the All-Eastern Women's Ensemble in Atlantic City, New Jersey for the annual NAFME Conference. Congratulations. In drama, it was another year of accomplishments for Liberty High School. Will the senior members of the cast and crew of Once Upon a Mattress please stand? This performance was nominated for 17 individual and group awards at the CAPES, the Maryland High School equivalent of the Tony Awards. A number of seniors were among the individual award winners. Will Lauren Bishop and Claire Vervak please stand? Lauren won the award for Best Actress in a Musical. This year, two Liberty students earned superior rankings at the Maryland International Thespian Society State Champion and the right to move on to nationals. Claire earned a superior rating in stage management and qualified for nationals. Congratulations. These are all truly great accomplishments and congratulations to each and every one of you. 